What's going on guys? Vic VP back with another Game Case Arcades video. Five times. Five times. Free 99 Marketplace find. <laughs> another Mega Touch has come back to the garage. I'm about to be called a Mega Touch Doctor. Let's take a look. Alright guys, you know Drill for not man, all the socials, what are you waiting for? Be sure to follow me at Vic underscore VP, Instagram, TikTok, Facebook, YouTube. What are you waiting for? Be sure to like, subscribe, and comment down below. I always say it, every game room needs a mega touch. I just keep finding these. <laughs> I said to myself on the last one, I was like, I'm not gonna get any more of these, especially the max cab designs but I just have this thing where it's uh it's free so you just gotta grab it if it's free it's free grab it and then ask questions later gonna do it live I'm also shooting this in 4k let me know how you uh does it look different I don't know you tell me <laughs> I have cameras that could do 4k and I never really recorded in 4k because it takes up a lot of room and it also kills batteries on cameras much faster Whatever, yada, yada, yada. Be sure to follow me on all the socials. What are you waiting for? Go follow. <laughs> you would see the behind the scenes. Everything behind me and behind there, and you're going to see a little sneak peek of something. Go follow. What are you waiting for? Come on. Again, another hot day in New York. Sweaty pits all day. It's actually really funny, and I've kind of noticed it in the videos. I kind of tend to wear the same type of shirts or same shirt, um, I should say. These are like my work shirts. So they get dirty, it is what it is. Um, and it's actually kind of funny, I don't think you could see it. I just unloaded this off the truck and I, uh, I ripped my pants. <laughs> so I do have like work pants as well. And yeah, these will go in the garbage, so don't look down here. Uh, <laughs> I literally took it off the truck, went wide leg and I heard a rip, but yes. Ladies and gentlemen, we are looking at another Mega Touch. This is considered like the max edition, especially with this cab version. But it looks like, it looks a little different than normal, than I've usually experienced. Um, this does have a bill acceptor, which is actually exciting. I'm getting a lot, a lot of requests for Pandora box builds, but they want bill acceptors. So I can at least take this. This right here is well worth the trip. You can probably get a bill acceptor for about a hundred bucks, maybe even more, but I'm gonna now try to see if I can get this to work with a Pandora box. But. I'm just excited, the guy had it in his house. He said his wife got a hold of it. It's been in his basement for like six months. It's never worked. Uh, he just said, Vic, just get this out of the house. He had seven steps. Uh, luckily he did help me, but I think I'm at a point, especially, I mean, I, you, I, you're not gonna see another pinball machine right now, but if I find a good deal on a pinball machine, I'm getting it. I might as well invest it in Escalera, where it goes down the steps, because same thing with the Golden Team. Uh, you know, that woman had steps, but she put it outside. It's, I might as well invest and save my back. But I'm excited. I'm going to do this live on camera. We're going to power this thing on and we're going to see uh, does it work? I don't, I have nothing. I didn't try it out. Again, I go to the person's house. It's like already at the door. Uh, I'm not going to go there and plug it in and complain. It's free. He's like, Vic, just take this. It's actually very funny. He posted this last week. Uh, and obviously I get the hit and he had it down for one dollar, but he just said there it's free Take it out of the basement bring two people. It's heavy seven steps. It's in the basement um, I always go solo luckily he helped me out. It was just you know, you gotta you know go up the steps with it um, It's actually funny. I messaged him last week. I had a pinball tournament I was actually gonna go with my brother, but pinball tournament ended late um, I messaged him yesterday. This is now Sunday uh, I messaged him yesterday, Saturday, I said, hey, do you still have that Mega Touch? He goes, yep, you're the only person that has messaged me about this. I'm like, all right, I'm going to come by tomorrow. If you can help me take it out, we'll take it out. So, yes, again, it's free. Mega Touch is due now, at least in New York. It's this style a lot. Uh, yeah, they, they come up a lot. I don't remember what video I did, but I did another free. I think it was the, the, the Golden Tee. I did mention that I had a... Another mega touch that I grabbed, that was the green base, same style, this max style cabinet. Um, 
The CRT didn't work on it, so I just gave it away for free. Somebody came to pick it up. And I said to myself, when I went to go get that one, I was like, I'm not gonna look at these maxes. And uh, yeah, we're, we're back to this. There's just something, uh, what's the wording? And some people might appreciate this. There's something about like, somebody, this doesn't work, so somebody's gonna throw it out. And it's like, you know, I would rather it not get thrown out and then let me at least try to get it to work. Uh, you know, that's, I'm like, you might be like, Vic, you said you're not gonna get another one. I know, but it's free. It's like, you know, if I could save it somehow, I have either, you know, I could donate this if it's working. I could obviously try to sell it. Mega touches though, at least this style and the, I, I consider this the Max, M-A-X-X. -X. This is the Max editions. These are like the older ones. Most likely gonna have like unicorn boards on it. Yada, yada, yada. You're all just here like, I wanna be here. Let's just power this thing on. Let's, let's see what happens. Now, like I said, I didn't power this thing on at the guy's house. We, it was no joke, like a five minute, back the truck up, pulled into his driveway and hauled it away. So without further ado, we're gonna do a first power boot up. I also mentioned to him, I was like, do you know if the CRT works? He goes, I think it does, but I honestly don't know. Let's see. We got a PC boot, yes! That's like the main thing. As long as we have something on the CRT screen, that's like the main thing right now. I'm actually surprised by it. It's a CRT. Now also another note, this is a smaller CRT than what is usually in this. So, it's interesting. What do we have here? It doesn't even have the fucking, the VGA is not even plugged in. Not pull it too much. Okay. <laughs> let's see, let's see. Disc boot failure. Insert system disc and press enter. Disc boot failure. So maybe the hard drive? Hard drive spinning. I right now, awesome. The CRT works, it looks beautiful. It looks pristine. That is always, anytime I get these, that is the number one scary thing. So right now, this could be something simple. I'm happy now, I'm excited. I'm happy I saved this. <laughs> All right guys, quick update. Just spent about 30 minutes on this. I am like mind blown, like. I actually, you can't see it on camera. I'm gonna wind up taking this sticker off. Um. This says Force 2006. So the board that's in this is actually updated. It is not running Max. I am like mind blown. And it just goes to show you that I'm, I'm, I'm happy I went out to get this. You have no idea, I am ecstatic that I went out to get this. And if you don't know what I mean, uh, you know, there's Max, Force Ion. Those are the three years for the Mega Touch. The Max is like, they're old. They're older games. But this right now could be updated to the latest or last rendition for Force, which is apparently on my research 2011. Right now, the hard drive in this is dead. It doesn't work. It's not, maybe it's corrupt. I had my Max, my trophy wall. I have a Max hard drive plugged it in and it went through like the boots. It, you know, it was getting past like the initial, like whatever script. And um, I can now just easily say, I need a new drive. So there is a guy on eBay I always get from him. Um, dude, you're looking at right now a $50 fix, 50 to 55. It's a $47 SSD. It's an SSD now. So it's going from the spinning drift drive to SSD plus $8 to ship. Insane. I am like mind blown. I am mind blown because if now that I see how this is, I'm gonna have to definitely take a lot of detailed pictures and videos because in case I get another Max edition, I'll know how to swap it out. This is, uh, yeah, I li oh, can I take this off right here? This might come off. I, like I said, I'm right now so mind blown. I'm like, wait, this is running force. And it says it on the intro screen, Force. 
This is this looks stupid. Like this this Mega Touch sticker that the person put on it. It's like the newer Ion sticker. I'm gonna take this off, and you're gonna see hopefully. And again, luckily, whoever did this, the sticker is on the outside of the plexiglass. This is just like a protective coating. Let me not bore you. Get this sticker off. Yeah. I'm gonna have to, you know, decrease. I'll take a heat gun. Luckily, like I said, this is the outside of it. Look at that. And the real reason I discovered it is because I had the machine on. What? It's running a force. I'm like mind blown. You have no idea how mind blown I am right now on this. Like absolutely mind blown. I took out the PC power. There it goes. I'm like totally mind blown right now. Ordering a hard drive. This was, I am happy that I went out. I'm happy, very happy that I went out to get this. You have no idea. Yeah, we just have a boot failure. So the hard drive is dead, but that's A-OK -okay because it's gonna be an SSD, so it's gonna boot faster. We're gonna have the last year. Oh, this, we're coming back. All right, so fast forward three days later, new drive came in. I always get it from this dude on eBay. His name is Mega M Bit on eBay. He sells the Mega Touch hard drives. Whatever version you need, if you have an Ion, if you have a Force, if you have a Max, Keyless, that's also another big deal. Anyway, July 23rd, I placed the order. That's when I shot this video. Today's July 26th. Three days later, SSD sent to me. He also sent me a RAM chip. Um, you know, RAM. Apparently this version needs more RAM than what it originally had. The dude is awesome. 50 bucks later, we have a fully functioning Mega Touch. It is a thing of beauty. Again, this is a CRT, so I don't know how it looks on camera right now. You might see a scrolling effect. That's just with CRTs. But this is probably the cleanest CRT Mega Touch I've ever I've ever seen. Um, mind blowing. And again, all it needed was one quick drive. That, that's all it needed, man. This is, like I mentioned before, I wasn't gonna pick this thing up. Anytime I see these Max Cab, you know, these fat boys, I was like, I'm not gonna, I'm, and I'm telling you right now, I'm very happy I went to go pick this thing up. Now it's pretty cool, the day I went to go pick this thing up, the guy that was giving it away on Marketplace, he actually messaged me that night. He was like, hey Vic, my nephew said, possibly you might need a whole new motherboard, it might need a new PC. I said, dude, don't even sweat it, I've, I've had my fair share of mega touches. Uh, he basically said, hey Vic, if you get it working, just let me know, I'd like to hear the outcome of it. Uh, so I will let him know that it just needed a new hard drive. Uh, again, it's very difficult to shoot this. I am also shooting this in 4K, so uh, I don't know. I feel like I'm in slow motion. I don't know why, but it is what it is. All in all though, again, something about this CRT. The CRT actually, what company is this? It's a beautiful, it says Tatung, T-A-T-U-N-G. Is that what this is? Chungwa. Yeah, Tatung Chungwa. Uh, that's a CRT that I've never heard of. Um, I don't know, if I do click on, I forgot what I clicked on. I don't wanna press the wrong button. But yeah, if I like open up the menu, I don't know if you could see it there. It's got like a very nice like menu. This is running 60 Hertz. <laughs> it's, it's got really great brightness control. It's contrast. I've never really seen a CRT with this type of menu style. But uh, they said, all in all, man, what a, what a score. This is great. I'm basically shooting this video with you guys. And then I will be shooting this to go. I pushed the wrong button. This will be going, I'm sorry. Done. This will be going up on Marketplace. This is it. I basically have to kind of just scrape off the residue on this. 
But all in all, man, this is just amazing. And again, I always say it, if you have a game room, man cave setup, it's always good to get a touchscreen system. You can't go wrong with these. This is just, and the, the touchscreen, the sensor on it, it's a thing of beauty. It is flawless. I am mind blown. I have no idea. And all I can say is, thank goodness I went out to go pick this thing up. That's all I, that's all I can say. <laughs> now the one that the drive seller did let me know, um, he usually doesn't have all the games active. This right here, this Force 2011, uh, again, this is the last year for Force before Ion came out. Um, this is really meant for LCD. And uh, he said, hey Vic, you know, some people activate all the games. Some of the games are, are more high resolution than the classics. I went and I just kind of enabled all the games and uh, it works. You do have your adult side of things. Um, it's actually very funny. My buddy Brad D, he just put his Mega Touch in his house. So I told him, I was like, hey, if you could do 11 ball, like it's a great math game. If you get all down, it's, it's very addicting. So Brad D is enjoying his Mega Touch. This one right here, again, I can't, I can't, I can't say it enough. Again, this is a clean drive, so there's no high scores on it. Man, what a, what a score. This is, I'm very happy with this one. Again, the only thing that's kind of throwing me off is the, the size of the screen. Uh, and again, this right here, like this actual hood, this plastic here, it's, it's like, it's actually, it, I thought this could come out, like this is like a punch out. No, this is like the way the, the screen is made. Now, real quick before we end this video, let me show you how I mounted this SSD. This was not meant to have an SSD. I don't want just kind of cables flailing around. Let me show you how I mounted the SSD. Now again, this goes up like a car hood. This right here, what a what a design. It's almost like a golden tee design. This right here just kind of clips up just like that. There's a couple of metal pegs here, but take a look real quick. There you go. This right here is the SSD right here. This is actually custom mounted. Uh, originally, this comes in this kind of like metal cage. And this right here is the dead drive. The dead drive kind of, you know, sits here. It goes in here. It's got this little like nipple here that stays in. And then you got your connectors all about here. I have the actual drive upside down. It should be like this. You got your power. And then, like I said, this has like that 24 pin connector. And it's actually very funny. I have the same exact hard drive connector adapter in my z back in the basement of my force 2011 uh like i said when i shot the video i was like i didn't really realize the connectors but yeah i basically took this metal cage uh again the ebay seller sells you it sells you everything you see here with the cage and he also gives you the adapter here i basically put two holes i i i kind of just you know screwed this down and that's it. This isn't going anywhere. And again, it's an SSD. Look at that, it just kind of drops in. Whee! That's it, that is mounted. Now they like said this right here, this is basically useless. I usually will save the cage, but this drive is dead. I was actually trying to see what is the gigs on this or even megs. Uh, this one actually right here, this SSD is 240 gigs, but Mega Touch, they're not even, I don't even think they're like a gig. <laughs> I could be wrong, don't quote me on that. But yes, this right here, the drive was made, it says uh, March, uh, February, February 26, 2002. Amazing, crazy, right? It's just, it's always mind boggling how all this works. But all in all, man, look at that, just like a car hood. That is it. Add it to the books. Another Mega Touch. What I thought was a Max actually is a Force Edition. Free 99 Facebook Marketplace find. Man. Now again, I do have this up for sale right now. If you are interested, you can always DM me, but it most likely will be gone by the time the video goes out. Um, again, posting videos of this on marketplace and hopefully it's sold if not it will be tucked in the back in the corner this one should actually sell 
uh, versus a max edition. And yes, like I said, I did get this for free, but business is business. There you guys have it, Vic VP Game Case Arcades. Another free 99 Marketplace find. Look. Uh.